Hey guys, my name is Simpsy. How are you all doing? Welcome back to some more FIFA 17, my player career. We're playing as Manchester United. This is episode 14 of season 3 and the final episode of season 3. Welcome, welcome back guys. In today's episode, we have the FA Cup final at Wembley against Pochettino's Tottenham Hotspur. Myself and Neymar, yeah, myself, Neymar and Mkhitaryan up front. Leading the line and Dabala in the midfield. Later on, we have the Champions League final against Bayer Leverkusen. My third Champions League final in three years. Depending on the results for this episode, primarily the Champions League will depend, well, will kind of make me make the decision to end the series because we've done three seasons, 14 whopping episodes and uh, I think I might end it on my boyhood club. Depending on the results, we'll just have to see how we go. We've just won the Premier League with United and we're on track to hopefully, um, yeah, win some cups. We didn't get picked in the EFL Cup final, the Carling Cup against Everton. They actually lost. I think hopefully they've uh, learnt from their decision, Jose Mourinho. CMC finds Ander Herrera, who whips it over the bar just before the fifth minute. Not bad from the Spaniard. Mkhitaryan. CMC. Hang on, there's a bit of skill move here. I've managed to maintain possession. Feed through Mickey. Back to CMC. Shot on target. It's uh, Loris with a nice grab. Deli Ali finds Hyung Min Sun. One Yama offside. Number seven, Hyung Min Sun. Oh my god, Devok Origi with the shot on target. We're in the second half now. Cipron, the Frenchman. Oh, I, that's a great strike from myself. Damian, Damian, come on, get it back in. Eric Dyer with the clearance. Harry Winks on the counter attack. One Massa playing for Spurs puts a. Cutting pass. Oh my god. Who went to ground then? That was so risky. Yes. Eric B in the 120 minutes. Oh, fuck off. That's some bullshit right there. On the counter attack. Nil, nil. I could have scored. It's gone to penalties now. Cipron steps up and nails it into the back of the net. This is nail biting for the FA Cup because I can't control it. Yes, 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 yes. David De Gea with the second save. It's still 1-0. Anthony Martial stepping up. He came from France. And the English press said he had no chance. He's just scored again. Sarko, the former Liverpool man, stepping up. He's put it to the left. And David De Gea has picked it up. Mike Smalling. Will we get Mike Smalling or Chris Smalling? We get Mike Sp Smalling. He scores. He's an animal when he's Mike. Not so good when he's Chris. Oh. One Mata stepping up against his former side. One Mata. Oh, goes to the left. Beats the Spaniard, David De Gea. 3-1. Neymar. My Barcelona counterpart. We moved in the same window. He's oh, he's missed. No galasso for Neymar. Devo Corrigi steps up. A lot of former Liverpool players in this. He's put it into the back of the net. It's 3-2. Simpsy. It's Simpsy's chance to put it into the back of the net to make... I'm going to go straight down the middle. <gasps> oh, I've missed. Oh, to be fair, I think that's my first ever penalty. It's 3-2. It's up to Lamella. He needs to score this. He skies it! It's 3-2. David De Gea has prevailed. I've run out to him to jump on him. I lift up David De Gea in the FA Cup final. Tumultuous scenes here in the FA Cup final. Winning on penalties. We've officially done the double. We've beaten Tottenham Hotspur 3-2 in the FA Cup. One matter there facing his former side. Moved to... Uh, Pochettino Tottenham earlier in the series. Uh, apparently, <laughs> this is season three, of course. High fiving with uh, Marcus Rojo right next to Neymar and David De Gea. Rojo's going to be lifting the trophy, and that, that is my second. Well, I guess that's my. Yeah, it's my. Well, it's not my second in a row because I went to Barca. But anyway, it's still my second FA Cup, my third European title. 
uh, league title that is a one with Arsenal dormant of course but now it is time to hopefully go out and uh, bring home the Champions League we're also going to be going through the squad report it's interesting to see that Mourinho went with a five at the uh, as a three at the back there Asana Diussi I wasn't too sure who that was exactly he signed from France uh, and Cipron here signed from Nice central midfielder for just shy of 40 million pounds 85 overall we have the Champions League final in Paris against Bayer Leverkusen Martial 88 overall here is the squad report and then I'll I'll go through my specific player stats as well. Um, Galero Barela, or whatever his name was, my god, that fucking guy in real life. If you guys haven't heard the story about that, got a tattoo just before the Duce Polcal uh, for Frankfurt. Had his loan terminated, and now he's back at United. I kind of hope United sell him, if I'm being honest with the Uruguayan. He did a stupid, stupid thing for his career. Anyway, it's time for a new haircut for, of course, the Champions League final. I'm going to go back to my long hair with the headband one. The ponytail was... I was kind of getting a little bit sick of it. Hopefully, it doesn't give me too much bad luck. Here are my traits. You're most welcome to pause and have a look at it. Bicycle, fitness, outside the foot, and the... Swerve pass. So we're facing by Leverkusen, a pretty good squad. Hopefully, it hasn't been picked apart. Obviously, we are three seasons in the future. Uh, uh, Leno is a good player for them. Halilovic, well, not anymore. He plays for Las Palmas now. Uh, myself, Neymar leading the line. Dabala, Fosu Mensa, Bay Rojo, Damian, Luke Shaw, and David De Gea in goal. We're playing at the Stadio Olimpico in France. Pretty even, neutral ground. Probably the same sort of distance from, of course, Bayern. Leverkusen to uh, France and of course uh, England to France as well. Marcus Rojo is the captain. I thought David De Gea would be but uh, he is unfortunately for them. So let's see uh, who is in goal for them. So Leno, okay. We are probably facing our former player um, uh, Javier Hernandez. They've got a pretty solid squad though. Jonathan Tarr uh, of course Jedvi the Croat. I'm right next to Neymar both moved in January myself and him and uh, hopefully we can uh, win my third Champions League in three seasons. Dortmund Arsenal here we go with United Simpsy on the ball playing really deep here sort of a defensive forward here myself and Neymar linking up Fosu Simpsy gets the shot on target but it's just gone wide to the right Leno at full stretch not bad I feed it to Fosa oh maybe Jonathan Tarr got a bit of a nick onto that Simpsy back on the ball loses possession do you see fires it back at me a couple of Ronaldo drops trying to create some space man I'm getting man marked here by Bellarabi big time outside the area I couldn't get it down too many skill moves I had the ball all over the place fuck Henrik Mikatarian. Simpsy trying to get some space for Mickey come on Mickey finish it he puts it wide Simsy late in the second half. Will it go to penalties like against Tottenham? Come on. Who's this? Eric B up front. Martial trying to whip it across the face of Leno. Oh, Neymar. B. Not bad from the centre back. We're in extra time now. Being dispossessed. Dabala with the cutback. Well, Simpson with the cutback from Dabala. Luke Shaw finds Neymar. Neymar whips it into the box. Martial sees me over the back. Oh, my God. Yes. Yes. How intelligent was Martial? Martial in a contested, heavily, like, closed down position. Whips it over the top. I have never, never seen the AI be so intelligent. Whips it over the top past the goalkeeper and the centre back. I communicate with him saying, back door, back door, hit him. And Leno did get a glove to it, but it was so far wide. Man, I lash my right foot onto it. It's 1-0 in the Champions League final. How has Leno even got a glove to that? 1-0. Jose Mourinho, ecstatic. And hopefully going to win another Champions League for him. Last time he won it with, 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 with uh, was Inter Milan, I do believe. Maybe with Madrid. Did he win it with Madrid? I can't remember off the top of my head. CMC finds Eric Bay. We've got a good counter-attack on here. Surely we're going to make it. 
Tunil Anthony Martial goes himself. He puts it into the back net. Where's he running? Is he running to Jose? He does to Anthony Martial celebrating with the gaffer. I've always wanted to do that with him, but I, I always seem to run and get in a, <laughs> a team player. Ander Herrera, Neymar coming in, Luke Shaw. Congrats, Martial. It's 2-0. Here we go. I gave him a good high five and a pat on the head. Eric Bailly coming a little bit later. It's 2-0 against Bayer Leverkusen. And I'm going to claim my third Champions League within three seasons. Incredible stuff. Six teams in three seasons as well. Six goals for Anthony Martial. Bayer Leverkusen. Kevin Volland. Top rack. Oh, my God. It's offside, thank God. But they put it into the back of the net past David De Gea. It's still 2-0. Yedvai over the top to Javier Hernandez. Chicharito, the small P, the small jumping P or whatever it is. Yedvai. Oh, what a ball in. It's 2-1. They could come back from this. They've still got five or so minutes. What a great ball in. Kevin, Kevin Voland, Hendricks. They've got a really, a really strong, exciting young squad by Leverkusen. But that's it. The full-time whistle has blown, and we have claimed the Champions League final here today. Thank you guys for watching and supporting this My Player series. I've made the decision now to end the series here now for the time being. Let me know in the comment section down below. Do you agree? Do you disagree? I, I feel like I'm, I'm sort of done at the moment, at the time of recording. The thing is, like I said, I started off in Salzburg. I, start, I went from Salzburg to Sunderland. I won the Premier League. Sorry, I won the uh, Bundesliga and Champions League with Dortmund. I did lose the Domestic Cup, but I have no ambition to go back and face, play in the Ducha Pokal, <laughs> play for it. In my second season, I won the treble with Arsenal, the Premier League, the FA Cup, and the Champions League. And now in my third season with United, I've gone now and, uh, and won the Premier League, the FA Cup, and the Champions League. I did have a small stint at Barcelona, but with a disagreement with the board, myself and Neymar both moved to United in the January. So, we'll go through my player stats. Three seasons in from starting a my player career, we're 86 rated. How insane is that, guys? So, we'll go through the stats and I'll show you what's up. So, for season four, should I do it? Let me know in the comments. I could. We've got a couple of options, right? We could do another season with United and try and win the treble again, back to back with United. Uh, we could have a break and maybe move on to football manager. Maybe just start another brand new fresh career. We could do another my player. Maybe playing, I don't know. I think playing in goal would be quite exciting. Perhaps even a centre back or a defensive midfield. I feel like a winger or an attacking midfielder would be too too much of the same as, of, of the striker. But the thing is, I prefer playing as a striker in my player career. Maybe I could just role play as someone else. Some complete stranger. 86 rating. 94 finishing within three seasons. We have shot up in stats. It's absolutely bonkers. Nothing is set in stone, though. Everything is debatable. Nothing set in concrete. Let me know in the comments your thoughts and opinions. So there's the news. You're most welcome to pause and have a look at it. However, we do have the, um, the World Cup right around the corner. So I could bring it back for like a World Cup special or... Or something, I'm not entirely sure. £44 million I am worth. It's glitched and says I arrived from Arsenal for 39 I really arrived from Barcelona. And that was more for about my what my worth was, which was about 40, 40, um, 44 roughly, roundabout. 94 ball control, 94 finishing, 92 dribbling, 91 sprint speed, 90 stamina, and 89 acceleration. I played 137 games, won 122, drew 10, <laughs> drew 10 lost 5, and scored 194 goals. What? I earn £180 per week at United. When I was at Barca, I was earning 200000 to 20,000, I think. Only two yellow cards, zero red cards, six clubs, three league titles, two domestic cups, and three continental. Coming from Dortmund, Arsenal, and uh, Manchester, of course. There are my uh, objectives. 
Here's the Premier League table. Aston Villa, Sheffield Wednesday, West Brom getting relegated. United winning by a clear 14 points, winning the FA Cup. We lost the EFL Cup. I didn't actually get picked in the starting 11, so we could have gone on and won four if they had chosen me. They lost uh, 1-0 to uh, Everton. Uh, St. Etienne won the Europa League. Uh, Austria leading the World Cup qualifier group stages, which is really, really good for them. I'll go through the team stats now, how many goals I scored for United this season. I was the top goal scorer with 25 goals, Griezmann with 14, Martial with 9, Mkhitaryan uh, sitting in 5 as well. So, I was not even the top goal scorer, believe it or not. I scored 25 goals this season. Leroy Sane scored 27. That's insane. Eden Hazard finishing in 21. But uh, Man City finished in second, no less, with 27 goals from Leroy Sane. Um, who else was up there? Griezmann with 11 for that. But I didn't even get the golden boot. That sucks. That really, really does suck. Let's see how the other league shaped up around the world. Did I make the right decision leaving Barcelona for United? Watford, Hull, and Brighton getting promoted. Paris winning... Their league, Dortmund winning the Bundesliga. Juventus winning Syria. Could do a stint in Italy, perhaps. Um, if I was to play for anyone, probably be Florentine, if I'm being honest. That's the team I support in uh, Syria. I really do quite like them. I have, a soft, I have a spot in my heart for them. I have a soft spot for them. Porto winning the Portuguese league. And drum roll, guys. Who is going to win... The La Liga, it was Barcelona, followed by Real Madrid Atletico. But of course, I don't know how well they did in the Domestic Cup for, of course, uh, the La Liga, but they didn't win the Champions League. So did I right, make the right decision leaving Barca? Let me know. Maybe I should go back to Barca. Maybe I should join Los Blancos. Maybe I should start a whole new career. There's a lot of stuff up in the air. But thank you very much, guys, for watching this My Player series. It's going to be on hiatus for a bit. But, yeah, sort of stay tuned. I, I, I could do it. I might not. So, um, yeah, don't get your heart set on a, a season four if I'm being honest. But yeah, thanks guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my social media links if you want to stay connected with me. Facebook, Twitter and Instagram all in the description below. If you guys want to get yourselves some cheap and reliable games, perhaps some PSN and Xbox codes to buy packs, check out my G2A affiliation link in the description below. That's it, guys. Patreon, Steam Group there as well. Stay tuned for more videos on the channel. Uh, even if I don't do more of this series, I definitely still be will be replacing it with another and still, uplo still uploading more videos. So stay tuned for that. My name has been Simsy. Make sure to take care of yourselves. Go out and have a fantastic rest of your day. Make sure to take care of yourselves, guys. My name has been Simsy. Goodbye. Mares whips it into the box. Royce! <laughs> that is just ridiculous. With the layup, Marco Royce.